roadways in the valley seem busier and more people around town crowding shopping centers. UTRGV sociology professor says that's because the valley is growing at a rapid rate. It grows approximately 20 percent per decade which is quite impressive, you know, for the United States. Hidalgo County Precinct 4 County Commissioner Joseph Palacios wants an accurate census count in 2020, which would best represent the amount of people in the valley, contributing to an increase in federal and state assistance the county needs as it grows. Whether it's infrastructure, whether it's public health, uh, whether it's anything, uh, we need to count as, we need a, a fair count uh, so that we can help our people. In 2010, the county asked the Census Bureau for an adjustment after the county felt the numbers were off and was actually higher than the 774,000 counted. One factor for the miscount being the amount of people who live in rural communities. A lot of the people that live out there are either documented and undocumented. That is why Hidalgo County and other border counties are defined as hard to count. Even the documented individuals, when they see a... a um, a government unit, any, anybody that has anything with federal on it, uh, it's just they're very, they're very reluctant even to participate, even if it's as simple as a census count. A 2015 count showed over 90 percent of residents in Hidalgo County are of Hispanic origin. And there are no questions on the census about citizenship status or um, whether or not people were foreign born even. Having some good communication about the the fact that there is not a risk to unauthorized immigrants. A major factor on whether Hidalgo County hits the million population mark is the migration rate. Currently the growth in Hidalgo is about at the pace of what we refer to as our 0.5 projection scenario, which is half of the migration last decade. If the migration rate stays steady, the county is projected to hit over the million mark. In Hidalgo County, Priscilla Estrada, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com. And Palacios adds the county wants to be ready for the future and grow with the population.